Hey everybody, Derek here from Badgerland Birding. I wanted to talk about some behind the scenes kind of stuff that uh, the viewers don't normally get to see and something that YouTube has been doing that's really negatively affect our channel lately. And uh, to get to that, we kind of have to talk a little bit about how people make money off YouTube and how that all works. And so as a creator, when you start a channel, normally your goal is to get your channel monetized. So that means that if you reach a certain threshold, I think it's a thousand subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time over the past year, then you can monetize your channel, which means that the ads that play on your channel, you then get a portion of the revenue from. YouTube gets some and then you get some. So as a creator, that's kind of your goal. And as far as I know, it used to be you could not monetize your channel and there wouldn't be ads on it. But now, even if you don't have your channel monetized, YouTube still puts ads on it, so YouTube just makes the money instead of you. Uh, you do have some control over like how often those ads play and all that kind of stuff, but that gets into some more you know, technical stuff about numbers, revenue, and all that. Uh, but anyways, that was kind of the goal as a creator, is hey, I can get monetized and make some money off my YouTube channel, and then you know, I can do this as more of a career. So that's kind of how, how YouTubers make money off their ad revenue. And then... You, we can do other things like, you know, there's affiliate marketing, you can do programs, things like that to kind of build off of that. So we've been growing our channel, been doing really well this spring. Things kind of slow down in the summer just because people are out doing stuff, they're busy, they don't spend as much time on YouTube. And then we got this notification on top of our analytics that said our views and revenue were being impacted by something called invalid traffic. And so I was like, that's kind of weird, but I just kind of brushed it off as like, oh, it's probably just something that, you know, is happening for a little bit and it'll get taken care of and then nothing will happen but then i looked at our revenue and our views had remained steady but our revenue had just cratered by like 50 percent our revenue got cut and so i looked it up and tried to find some more info about this and it looks like other creators like around the same time are having the same issue where it says their views are being impacted by invalid traffic and so what this means is basically youtube's trying to say that it means that some of your views are by like bots so basically just like there's systems or like an algorithm or something there's a way that your videos are getting views but they're not from real people it's so like then they're not actually like watching the ads and so they're like well you shouldn't get revenue from that yet the funny thing is instead of youtube taking ads off those videos they still have the ads they just don't give you the revenue so our revenue has been cut basically in half while youtube is still making the money off of those ads and so some people are saying this is a bug, like this is not happening, YouTube's just saying it is and they need to fix it. Other people are saying there actually is invalid traffic, but YouTube really doesn't tell you any way to get rid of it. Everything that they say to you is just, oh, stop doing shady stuff. And so we don't, like right now, we're not doing any advertising on our videos that like we put out ourselves. Um, we're not, you know, doing any promotional thing where there would be weird views. Some people said uh, stop embedding your videos in like blogs or other people embed your videos on blogs that this can lead to invalid traffic. But it's like we have a lot of educational videos that are great for blogs or if, if it's an article about IDs, they can watch our purple finch versus house finch video. So we don't really want to just turn off embedding. But YouTube doesn't tell you which videos this is occurring on. It gives you literally like no information. And this crater in views and revenue, it seems like it can go on for a minimum of seven days to basically like whenever they want. So we have no control over when this is going to get fixed or if it's going to get fixed. And uh, Ryan and I, we both have other jobs. We'd love to do YouTube and burning stuff full time. But right now we do have other sources of income. But if this is your only source of income and YouTube randomly just like I heard some creators being impacted, like 80 to 90 percent of the revenue has just been depleted because of this this bug. And even if it is invalid traffic, I'm calling it a bug because they don't tell you how to fix it. Like, that's the real problem, is if they said, hey, this video is doing this, it showed up on this sketchy site, you know, if you just get it off that site, then we'll return it to normal, that's fine. But they literally give you basically nothing to do. They're like, stop being shady. We're like, we're not being shady. And they're like, well, stop being shady. So it just feels like it's another strike on small creators and it just makes it harder for us to be able to generate revenue and kind of do more of this you know as our as our career so it's been kind of demoralizing especially when i feel like we've been growing but now it's kind of like it's less incentive to grow when your revenue has been slashed for apparently no reason so that's something we've been struggling with um just wanted to kind of make a video to talk a little about it um we're working on upping our other revenue streams as well we do the tours um we do some affiliate marketing 
and uh, we'll be looking at other ways to you know help make revenue as well but it's just kind of discouraging as a creator. I wanted to give you a little behind the curtains look and I'm hoping that this gets lifted sometime soon and that we'll see our revenue kind of go back to normal. So I'll keep you guys updated about what's going on, um, but not very pleased with YouTube or the way that they're running things at the moment. So uh, kind of a uh, demoralized, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Badgerland Birding. Yeah.